great swathe of the economy is being taken up by technology software companies. And we can see it all around us. If you think about how technology has already eaten the photography market, think about how software has eaten the video market, think about how software has eaten the music market, you think about the high street, you think about HMV, you think about Jessup's, you think about Blockbuster. We're nuts if we think that technology is not going to eat the advertising, marketing and communications industry. And what I mean by that is that technology is going to be doing a lot of the products and services that consumers care about and replace a lot of the jobs that are currently done by human beings. So the first reason it matters is this is part of a long-term shift, not a fad. A lot of us have worked in big companies. And I think innovation is becoming one of these words that is at worst meaningless, but at best means incremental change. This isn't about game-changing technologies. And by game-changing, I mean introduces new revenue streams, get customers to pay more for stuff, makes company money or saves them money, and therefore adds value back into the economy. And what the bakery does, importantly, this is why it matters, is it gets companies doing innovation, not talking about it, doing it with real live technologies. There's these two worlds, the worlds of brands and the world of startups, the world of big companies and the world of small, agile companies. And I come from a company called MC Saatchi, working with companies for about 10 years. And they're all saying, what we'd love to do, I hear this refrain loads, we'd love to innovate at the speed of startup. The startups are going, we can do that. We can build stuff really, really quickly. We can innovate quickly. But what we really need is we need to take stuff to market. We need that help. And what we do, certainly how I see it, is that we bring the best of two worlds together.